Hi everyone, this is Amy from Build Up Digital Marketing. You spoke with my partner Alin yesterday, and so here's the video we promised. And I'm gonna jump right into it. As you can see, I'm already on your website here, which is absolutely stunning. Beautiful work you do, and I really like. I really like that it's different than most websites. One thing I would add though is your phone number are a way to contact you i know you have your social media i'll link right here but i would add your phone number right from the get-go people just don't like to search for a phone number uh, but that's very very easy to to fix um let me see uh, those pictures how they were saved so see this picture was saved as best with a bunch of numbers a better way to save pictures would be to put your company name in there. You could put um, a location on where that specific job was done and also add some keywords in it. And that would help you rank in all those areas at once. Again, a very easy fix to do. A uh, quick fix for that. So keep in mind, I see a little bit of content here. A few keywords here and there. Keep in mind that Google likes to see an upward of 1500 words on a home page. I know it sounds like a lot, but it also makes it a lot easier to plug in those keywords that will help you rank in the long run. That is organically. And then you got all your information at the bottom against social media. You've got your email address and phone number at the bottom but i would definitely add it one more time in this general area uh, maybe just before custom home just that way people could contact you directly so for this oh and also one last thing at the bottom you could also add all the areas where all the location where you offer your services that way that will help you rank in those specific location so now i'm going to jump over to google where i did a simple search here general contractor in golden bc and a lot of time we have that first section that is the paid advertisement section there's no one running ads at the moment in this area uh, it's very efficient puts you at the very top of the first page however some people don't like to click on those links and they're likely to end up in this second section here which is the Google my business and as you can see there's all there's only three spots visible from the get-go I know you have your setup it's really important to get as many reviews as you can from your customers because that is the main thing that will help you rank in the Google my business and once again most people don't like to click on more businesses to find a company listed further so it's important if you want to maximize your revenues to have your company listed right here and next up we have the organic section so this is the part where we get all the directories here we've got Yelp we've got yellow pages and then we got better business bureau camp page so a lot of a lot of uh, directories here and we've got a few companies throughout and sometimes we also get see here we have a sponsored so that's an ad and here's another one right here so i use those guys here p construction and we're gonna go see what makes them rank on the first page so here on their website um i don't see a phone number to get in touch with them let me see that picture they put their name in there it's already that but a location with keywords in it adds to it i don't see much written content mm, not much going on so we're gonna go a little deeper in that and we're gonna go see with a tool i use that's called arif that i get a better insight of a website so here i did put in peak construction golden.ca and the first thing i notice is that they have a 403 uh, error message which is not so good then the first metric 
uh, that are the most important are the DR and the UR, those two he right here. They're basically the power and the trust Google gives to your website. And you get those numbers from backlinks and referring domain. So backlinks is anytime you've got another website pointing out at yours. And referring domain includes citation, which is every time you've got your name, phone number, well, your company name, phone number, and address listed, just like in those directories. So they currently have 23 and 3, and they're also ranking for 19 keywords. So we're going to go, uh, keep in mind, backlinks and referring domains are not all created equal, meaning that if you have a backlink coming from Pizza Hut, for example, is not it's not really relevant to construction and Google knows that. So Google goes with relevancy of the topic and that could be flagged as spammy. So we got to be careful because it could end up being detrimental in the long run. So you want to go for quality leads more. So let's go over onto their keywords. And so they currently are ranking for peak construction, peak construction. So it's just their name, basically they're ranking for. Uh, peak con peaks construction here has a volume of a thousand, meaning that it is searched a thousand times per month. Uh, it has very low competition, four is very low, a small cost per click, brought them zero traffic, puts them in 56 position. Oh, wait, hold on. We're in the States here. Going to switch it back to Canada. There's a couple more. Okay, there's a few more here. So here we got peak construction, volume 500, difficulty five, no cost per click, brought them 39 people to their website and puts them in fourth position. So this is the reason they come first. Uh, I see, so they have con golden construction. So they have a location, which is good to have because it's also will funnel basically people that are looking for a location and it won't be a national keyword and also you have to focus on the keywords that are buyer intent ones so interior renovation is good it would be a little better if it had golden in it as well because that way you could be, it's it's a buyer intent keyword. It's not people looking at a DIY project. It's people looking for a service, which is what you want if you want to convert them. So that with the location will definitely help. So overall, it's not, it's... I believe these would that company would be really, really easy to outrank, in my own opinion. So now let's move over to what's interesting to you. So here I put in hrpacific.com and you currently ha are at a 27 DR and a 10 UR. These numbers, uh, we try to get them as even as possible. Uh, ratio one to one is the best is what we're aiming for basically. So I can see here you have a hundred backlinks currently and you're adding some as well and you also working on referring domain, which is excellent. Um, so I see there was a bit of a drop in the organic traffic, but it came right back up. So that's great. We're gonna take a quick look at your keywords. I'm gonna switch that back to Canada. And here we have Mountain Pacific Chalet. See, those words are, you have your company right here, but none of those make you rank on the first page, as I can see. So there's definitely some work that could be done by adding written content that would definitely help you rank in the long run organically. So here you have it, Erin. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this was helpful to you. And we'll be keep we'll be reaching out to you following up in the next couple of days. Thank you so much again. Have a great rest of your day.